Hello, my name is Kiara Sino and I'm an investigative advisor at DigiStream Investigations. In my role as an investigative advisor, we work very closely with the field operation managers. They provide us with updates throughout the entirety of a surveillance case. They're working very closely with those that are in the field, checking in every few hours, ensuring that we're working it correctly. I communicate with the field operation managers pretty frequently. They keep us in the loop of what's going on with assignments while we're out in the field. They are our eyes and ears for those that are out in the van conducting active assignments. Um, what about all source analysts? Yeah, the all source analysts are a pretty essential role, especially for surveillance. While they do their own cases, they're also providing our investigators real-time updates. If we see something happening in the field and we want to get more information on a vehicle or an individual, they will have the all-source analyst take a look into it, give them additional insight, and give them real-time updates while we are out there. Let's talk about like the case intake process. Once we receive an order, an investigative advisor will be in touch to essentially confirm the case, ensure that we have a clear investigative goal, and in case we're missing any information, they'll ask about that as well. Once we have all that information, we'll enter it into our system and we'll begin the case. It's definitely important to have a clear investigative goal because it essentially allows us to help you. It allows us to tailor an investigation to what you're looking for. We can set up things in certain ways or we can narrow down or hone into something specific to help essentially meet what you're looking for. The final reports will essentially list your investigative goal and then what we found pertaining to that goal, as well as some other notable information regarding an individual social media or background records. So once we begin the case, you'll be receiving either next day videos or next day updates. Essentially, they're an update of how we went about the investigation, some notable findings. If we did observe the individual the day prior, you'll have a highlight reel of some of the most notable content. When I say highlight reel, they'll either be image at the top that will allow you to click right to your video or the link is down below as well. These updates are a big platform for communication. They allow us to essentially show you what happened the day prior in surveillance, show you what vehicles were present, who we're seeing in and out. It also gives us a time to talk about if we think we should start at another location, if we think we should switch up the game plan, maybe work an appointment or something of that nature. It will give us that opportunity to revisit the case, look at everything we have as a whole with the remaining time we have left to help meet those investigative goals that you were looking for initially. We definitely keep our equipment very up to date. All of our investigators are equipped with brand new vehicles, laptops, cameras, tripods, different gadgets. They're also equipped with maintenance cards, gas cards. We really keep our equipment very up to date and maintained to better assist in the outcome of our investigations and ensure we're getting that top quality. We definitely have a lot of equipment that allows us to do our job well. We have a variety of vetted databases. We also have different proprietary software that allows us to do our job in a easy manner. Why is it an advantage for, for you that we have access to all those databases when you need all that information? Every day. <laughs> <It's definitely laughs> Every day. <laughs> so Every many day, times. <laughs> we do. Um, Having access to all these databases allows us to look at all the information in a well-rounded manner. Having that allows us to compare addresses, look at vehicles, um, take a deeper dive into something that we really want to hone in on. Um, it also allows us to stay organized and ensure that we're getting all the information we need to begin these cases. When we complete a intel investigation, you'll be receiving a full report of all our findings um, with a summary that points out the most notable findings. Investigative advisor will be in communication with you and is able to do a verbal debrief if you would like. Um, and from that, we'll also give our recommendations on how to move further with this investigation and what we think could be beneficial to the, your specific goals. At the completion of a surveillance investigation, you'll get a full detailed written report from our investigator honing in on the hour-by-hour -hour updates of who we were observing, what was going on in our residence, and things of that nature. If any questions do arise or you would like any further detail into anything, you should reach out to your investigative advisor and they'll be able to give you additional details for whatever you are looking for. What makes the shoot better? What do you think the 
top three things that make us better? I would say how much we devote into our employees and their training. We take a lot of time to train each individual that comes our way, despite whatever position they are in. We also provide them advanced trainings once they're um, you know, passing their probationary periods and thing, hitting milestones. Another thing I think is great about Digistream is the access you get to investigative advisors. You can have as much of a hand in your investigation. I hear so many person. times from clients that they're so happy they have like a face on the investigation that you know they're getting regular updates, they're getting game plans and plans of action and thoughts from an actual individual. Sometimes, yeah. you know, that I think that's a huge advantage. Another thing could be our research and development departments is where both Intel and surveillance were constantly um, investing in what is next, what is new, what's upcoming, and how we can better do our jobs into the future as technology evolves, as we evolve, you know, as people evolve, we put a lot of effort into those research and development departments. While we do cover the entire country and Canada, we have over 20 offices that are localized to different areas. When you're communicating with those investigative advisors, they have insight into if it's, if it's an urban area, if it's a rural area, um, insight into major cities and how their transportation works and how to best work a case in those areas.